afternoon, everyone. On behalf of ASHA and his management team, we'd like to welcome you here this afternoon uh, for the presentation of our interim results. We believe that it is important for us to grow both our top and bottom line comparably. And then something that we've added whilst retaining our entrepreneurial spirit. So as we grow up and, and mature, we don't want to lose that very important thing that we believe has been key in our success. We've expanded what was previously a very large focus on the South African market to include the rest of Africa as well. Yeah, in terms of the highlights and, and the way forward, typically you would say this is it, no more acquisitions, it's only the, the, the Space. That is appropriate if you, let's say we had 40 or 50 percent of the market share. Our market share is, is around 5 percent. That's the reality. And uh, for us to, to continue to grow both organically and through acquisitions, it's still all available to us. We see question number one and they got the money to pay. When we look at an acquisition, somebody looks at us, okay? And he goes, the guy wants to sell the business to us, goes to, advise, to his advisor, the advisor will look at the balance sheet and say, yeah, they are safe, they've got money, they've got cash. And you always borrow when you have money, they haven't you learned it? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, uh, I say it in, without, without joking about it, okay, you go and try and borrow money when you've got, you've got the no assets, your net asset value is zero, uh, your debt is already hooked to somebody else, and you've got this great opportunity to, to buy something, to enter into a new field, and then you go and ask the bank to lend you money. They're not going to give it to you. And we've got plans, we've got lots of plans uh, in the business, and we always like to have cash on hand. The segmentation of the business is, is, is different, it's moving and it's shifting into services. And it's a trend that we, we want, it's a trend that we like, and our strategy is to, to, to continue to do it. Looking back at the last six months, and I'm not going to go into them, we have done well in most fronts of the business. Our market cap is $3 billion, this is brand, and more important than anything else, I think uh, we do have, we think, the best people in the industry, we have strong people, strong management, and, and an excellent value system. The culture of the business is healthy, and uh, my biased view of the business is that it's extremely strong in tenor. By April this year, in the next couple of weeks, we have 620 young people coming into the business. Uh, we say that uh, the role of business in job creation is far greater than the role of government in it. And, and business must take uh, responsibility to create jobs in the country. So looking into the future, outsourcing, managed services, cloud services will remain a major, major driver of our growth. We will continue to grow and become dominant in the enterprise application space, the information management so crucial. Again, public sector and state-owned enterprises, the BPO, the verticals. We believe we're going to continue to grow our market share, and we believe that the acquisitions will still complement our organic growth into the future.